Yeah, thank you, Will. Thank you very much, President. Today we're going to be voting on a fundamental revision of the asylum uh, policy. Nine years on from the migration crisis, we finally have something on the table to bring an end to the suffering on our borders, have stricter, stricter screening on our borders to make sure that genuine um, asylum seekers are protected and we deal with those quicker. So this migration pact will allow us to get control over the process. It is not the human smugglers who get to decide, it is the countries concerned. Of course, we're not going to have resolved all the problems like a wave of magic wand, but it is an important first step on which we need to build. Now, let's be clear here today. A vote against this pact isn't in favour of a better policy. No, a vote against this pact today is a vote for the maintaining of the current situation, for further several years of streams of illegal immigrants coming, a lack of reception conditions, lack of controls on external borders, for the business model of human traffickers and their, uh, their game that costs lives. Uh, a vote against this is a vote for the status quo and that's why the extreme right the extreme left and the greens are trying to come together in some strange coalition against uh, you see Franz Timmermans and and then Gert Wilders so all sorts of people around Europe expect and rightly so that Europe will deliver here it's a huge amount of responsibility that all of us in this chamber today uh, have on our shoulders. Let us not run from this responsibility. Thank you. Thank you very much. Next speaker on behalf of the S&D group, uh, Gabriela Bischoff.